it's gonna go well. Yeah, I'm just really looking forward to having this time with Christina and just showing some, you know, appreciation and gratitude for all the work that she's done with the recent partnerships. And then, you know, at the same time, going for her Lean Six Sigma black belt. Yeah, that's exciting. Yep, uh, she'll be in the office here in about 30 minutes. So see you soon. Uh, my name is Maya Boykin. I'm the Director of Enterprise Program Management Office. What I do is I help h &P teams accomplish what matters most. <laughs> what I got to do today is meet with Christina, one of my employees who uh, is seeking out you know, further professional development. The partnerships that you developed with all the other leaders there at h and I just I really want to commend you for that. But it seems like it's working as designed. Yeah, it worked well to team up and have kind of a different personality with you. But once we got into it, it was easy to see the value add. I really want to encourage my team to seek out professional development that works well for them. It ultimately brings back benefits to h and and helps the team grow and evolve. After that meeting, we had a broader meeting, uh, EPMO Tactical. Next up is team recognition, and it looks like you guys are all overachievers and started filling this in ahead of time. So, uh, Maya, do you want to lead off with yours? One of the things we do in our tacticals that I really want to make time for is team recognition. How did we help each other out? As Derek goes for his PMP, Christina goes for her, her black belt. You know, you guys have all been here. Let's share information and knowledge and any, any tips and tricks that we can with them. This team is, is fantastic on being able to collaborate even amongst themselves and where they can plug in and help them more with, with what's going on in certain areas or projects that, that they're leading. I love that I am able to lead a fantastic and capable team that makes a difference every single day. I was lucky to be able to, to snag our executive, Che, and several of Che's directs to show them a readout report on all these different projects that we are capturing and tracking, ultimately getting their feedback. Does this make sense on what we're producing here? How might we identify our, our portfolio? Um, again, chasing strategy, uh, modernization, because I can see that trend changing over time. Once we are completed with this, it's going to kick off other projects right behind it with, with other, other financials. So we're not, we're not done yet. We've got a lot of things that are uh, being prepared to go into the queue for FY23. Towards the end of the day is a very um, uh, catching up with emails, scheduling meetings for later on in the week, and uh, touching base and circling up with people that uh, I had some action items to follow up on. Seatbelt. You hear about work-life balance, it's pivoted. It's life-work balance. Tell me about Lattice. Because of this remote, flexible environment. I'm so encouraged on how H&P has really been a leader in the oil and gas industry to embrace this new environment. And then uh, being able to, to come home and just kind of decompress sit down and just take a moment with my kids, you know, outside, reading a book. It was so good, Lily. I'm really proud of and you. And then, yeah, usually the kids are off doing their homework or playing with friends. And I jump back online and check back in, and, and my day usually wraps up around 6 p.m. I'm doing great. How are you? I'm doing great. Homer Campaign is a very unique company. It allows you to bring your best self and your capabilities to do your best work. And that is something that I am absolutely grateful for.